Hello and welcome. This is Chandni Nevdani and you are watching It's Tomorrow News. High winds, rough seas, a storm Atiha batters Britain. Storm Atiha has made landfall in Ireland, bringing high winds and rough seas as it tracks eastwards across the country. ESB Networks said its crews are dealing with several power outages with the southwest worst affected. Storm Hatia has hit Wales, Southwest England and Ireland, forcing flight cancellations and diversions and causing power outages in several areas. Western Power Distribution later confirmed to Sky News that at least 115 houses were without power. The first named storm of the season has brought gusts of wind of up to 79 miles per hour, which was recorded at 7 p.m. on Sunday in Rosh's Point, Kokork, according to Ireland's Meteorological service. It has also disrupted more than a dozen flights at Cork Airport which were either cancelled or forced to divert to Dublin or Shannon. The status red warning for Kerry was in place on Sunday. It is now under a status orange wind warning. Kerry County Council has reported a number of incidents following the status red wind warning. Met Arian said there was a possibility of coastal flooding due to a combination of high seas and a storm surge. Trains in Cork and Kerry were forced to travel at reduced speeds, resulting in delays. Storm Atia was tracking between Iceland and Ireland on Sunday. Although the UK is not expected to be as badly hit by the storm, the Met Office has issued a yellow wind warning for Wales, with gales of up to 70 miles per hour set to hit the coastal areas. The storm is due to move eastwards across the country through the night. The council said a tree is reported to have fallen on a car near Mount Cole Cross on the National Highway No. 69, while council crews in a dungeon removed a shed which blew onto a road. According to the Met Office, damage to temporary structures could be possible in the worst affected areas as strong gusts of wind up to 70 miles per hour are expected overnight. Seven other parks in the west of the country are also closed while the weather warnings remain in place. No warnings have been issued for Northern Ireland by the Met Office. However, gusts close to 60 miles per hour, that is 100 kilometers per hour, can be expected in western areas on Sunday evening. That's all for now. For more news updates, stay tuned with us. It's Tomorrow News, Chani Nebnani. For more weather updates, do like, share and subscribe our channel.